So I just watched another video of some clown with a camera running his mouth to an officer. I think it was in New York and calling him a bitch and a punk and take that badge and gun off and let's fight. So here's my question. A lot of you clowns like to do that. Y'all really think we hide behind our badges and guns and a lot of us obviously we, we can't fight. That's what y'all think, right? Okay, so how about if we come up with a system that the officer signs a waiver, you sign a waiver and put your camera down, we put our badge and gun down and let's step in the ring. Let's see how many of you would actually sign up since y'all, you know, you feel like we're a punk behind our badges and guns. I'll sign a waiver. How many of you gonna step in the ring with me? I'll wait. 24 hours later. You. So I've been getting all kind of messages and friend requests and all that good stuff. Guys, listen, it's pointless. Okay, I'm getting all type of professional boxers that have been bouncing, but boxing for 300 years and decide, okay, well, because this cop said this, I want to fight him. And that's the wrong answer. If you want to fight me, that's because I did something to you. Right now, half of you guys are running off at their mouth because of what I do for a living, but you've never personally met me and I've never done anything to you, nor me. So if you want to get in the ring, make sure if you have a valid reason besides what I do for a living. Oh, <laughs> bless that baby. It's hard. Listen, even his voice was shaking. Oh, uh, 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 y'all, listen. Oh, y'all, <laughs> real. I was talking. Okay, listen. <laughs> it was like he had been listening to DMX. Eric's gonna give it to you in the first one, and then afterwards he was kumbaya. Man. You know, it, I'm not the problem. You know, we should fight drugs. There's a war on drugs. Why y'all want to fight me? Now, we, I ain't got an issue. He was hurt. Like brother, brother, brother. You are so <laughs> lost. We got to come together. Understand me as the community. Now all this talk about violence. Who's talking about that? Right. Me? Me? No. I'm not talking about violence. See, that's what's wrong with us. Right. You understand me? We, it's always us against each other. We got to fight the man. The man. That's what we, we got to fight the Rona. Not me. <laughs> not me. The thing he forgot, muscles does not make you a fighter. At all. You're just strong, mm. right? But I've seen plenty of fight. And Devin Haney, the guy who's like, the boxer said, I'll glad you, gladly beat you up. Mm -hmm. He is not big. No, You know, but... most boxers now, Tyson Fury and Deon Deontay, mm -hmm. they're big. Yeah. But, you know, Floyd and Manny Pacquiao and... Devin Haney and, and, and uh, Mikey Garcia and Victor, those dudes are not big. They're smaller, yeah. But <laughs> they are precise. Yes, they are. And I guarantee you they would have beat the brakes <laughs> off of Officer Scared Voice. <laughs> At first, he, the first video, his muscles were all big. You he, know, he was. He had, a, he had just did some curls. He put on his rock. Uh, the bull t-shirt. He thought he was Dwayne the Rock Johnson. And then he turned to the side on the other one like, guys, <laughs> guys, God. listen, listen. I just want people to keep that same energy. energy man, he was like, man, y'all tripping, bro. Oh, Fight. He didn't want to get served that three piece from somebody be laid out on the floor Could with you... a quickness. <laughs> with a quickness. Not the three piece. <laughs> pop, pop, pop. <laughs> over. Game over.